oh I don't like the way it looks on a zip and I feel like that line really makes it look like you've got a camel toe <coughs> Oh my god. Hey guys, it's Demi. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Or if you just joined in as an now, welcome! I hope you're doing well. I hope you're having a fab day. So today we've got another haul styling video, but it's a first for the channel. We are going to be doing a combined haul. Now correct us if I'm wrong. If you've seen a combined haul on my channel before, you tell us. But I don't think I've ever done a combined haul. I feel like when I've done a haul, I've always ordered enough to do like one video. But today I kind of feel like combining these two hauls together because I styled one or two of the pieces together and yeah. So we've got a nasty girl and a pretty little thing haul. <laughs> which I'm so excited about. It's a pretty little thing. It's an OG. I love it. Shop there quite often. Cute staples, especially if you're plus size. Nasty girl. I've shopped there once or twice before. It's not as much of a staple for us, but it is getting it is getting close out of my heart because I feel like they are doing a lot more stuff recently, which I'm quite vibing with. And I feel like the plus size range is definitely getting a lot better because I feel like when I started looking at Nasty Girl, they never used to do that good of a range for plus size girls. I feel like it always used to be more like like your size 14 and under but more recently i found that they actually are catering for us so i'm very happy about that so today i'm going to be doing a nasty girl and pretty little thing haul and it's going to be a styling video because if you don't know i'm so into fashion at the minute i keep doing fashion posts on my instagram and i get really excited about fashion these days and i was never the type of person who would like i would never get excited to pair an outfit in the morning but all of a sudden i'm this pinterest girl and i'm like whoa which colors am i going to combine today on the body what am I gonna look like today what am I gonna wear so in anyway I am really into fashion and if you want to see more of my fashion posts follow us on Instagram because I am posting a hell of a lot more on there but yeah without further out -ta -ta, we're just gonna get into the video I hope you enjoy if you'd like us to do a haul from anywhere in particular let us know I really want to go around the supermarkets and do hauls because I was in Asda the other day and George at Asda is vibing I've done two hauls from there before and I really like the stuff I feel like the quality is amazing the price points good and they have such a good range of sizes and I was in Asda the other day and I was like they had so much stuff and I'm really tempted to just do like a supermarket series where we test all the supermarkets clothing and what I'll do is I'll do my weekly shops there so that I can get the clothes as well um, so let us know if that would be something you'd be interested in anyway without further ado I'll just get straight into the video and yeah I hope you enjoy Okay guys, so these are the first items that I got from Nasty Girl. So it's a little tracksuit set, which comes with joggers and this V-neck sweater. Now I thought this looked so, so cute on the model. And I was like, yeah, I'm gonna get that. I can style that. Like I know what I'm doing. I'm a fashionista now, but I'm not sure that it's really gone to the envisionment in my head. So I love the color of it because surprisingly enough, I'm actually really getting into beige and nudes. I'm really sorry to my best friend, Harry, who I absolutely slated for about a year for his wardrobe being full of beige and nudes. I was like, I hate beige and nudes. I will never wear brown. Slightly more of it is coming into the wardrobe. So sorry, Harry, please don't hate us. Anyway, I bought this set and I kind of don't love it, but I kind of don't hate it. The the tracksuits are wide leg, which not gonna lie, I love a wide leg. I am more of a flare type of girl at the minute, but I don't mind a wide leg, but they're just a bit too wide. And I think if I downsized it would have looked better, but the crotch area has got a very distinctive line. And I feel like that line really makes it look like you've got a camel toe, even though you haven't. But it's such a distinctive line down there. I feel like it ain't really doing much for us. So the joggers are an absolute no. Like I definitely wouldn't wear these unless it was like lounging around the house. But even then I still feel really conscious in them. The top I do like. Now I've underlayed it with this white turtleneck underneath. Now I do like this top. It has like a really like what would you call prominent stitching on the v-neck which i like it's short sleeved so you can layer it and make it look cute i probably would wear this but just not with the joggers i would wear this maybe with some nice jeans yeah just not with the actual item it came with because i just the pants aren't a vibe on me but i definitely would wear this and i feel like i have a few items like this in my wardrobe that i do like styling so this is something that i feel like i could reach for and i could try and style but just not with the pants like not together but maybe separate the top could stay but we'll have to come to some sort of arrangement okay guys so the next item i got is these beige trousers they're beige with like a burgundy check pattern on them i quite like these but again i should have downsized i feel like nasty girl sizing could be well I, to be honest i have 
I keep mixing between what sizes I am. I'm not really sure what my clothing size is at the minute, but I just feel like overall these look a little bit big on my leg area and they're really big on my waist, hence why I've had to put the belt on. I do like them. They're a really nice soft material as well. So I feel like the sizing just isn't working great on us and I definitely should have downsized on them. But other than that, I think they're a really nice trouser. I just would like them just to be a tiny bit smaller because, yeah, just feel a bit like baggy trousers at the minute okay guys so the next item i got is this dress t-shirt now i've actually styled this on my instagram it might be up before this video goes live or i might still have it in my draft but i really really like this i feel like it's quite a simple item but i feel like it can make for such a cute outfit i've tur i've turtled it i've turtled it you've turtled what i've paired it with a black turtleneck because i feel like the black might really contrast each other and i would wear my colorosa trainers they're absolutely scruffy because i wore them for a dog walk the other day so ignore that but obviously they're black and white um in the lace contract so i think they'd go nice together this is what it looks like i've paired it with my little gucci belt from lanzarote if you know you know and then i just have a gold statement necklace on this is from anna luisa but overall i think this is such a cute little outfit and i feel like it's just really nice for like a summer's day if you're going for a picnic and i quite vibe with it myself and i love the v-neck because it makes it look more slouchy and if you've watched any of my hauls i love a little bit of slouchy so i'm really vibing with this and i feel like this dress could go with so many outfits it's such a staple little piece and i'm really happy with it and i think i'm going to get the black version of it as well because i'd really like the black version you know when you find an item that you really like and it fits you well and you like the fit of it do you just want it in every color that it's available because i'm like that i'm like so like that if i get something that i like i buy it in every single color quite a bit of a problem but it's not a bad problem because it means that I can have loads of different outfits that I like in different colours. So yeah. Okay, the next item that I got from Nasty Gal I think is absolutely beautiful. It's this fake leather jacket. Now, I've wanted one of these jackets for the longest time. And leather is one of them things that I just think goes in and out of fashion all of the time. And sometimes I love it, sometimes I hate it. But I'm actually really in a love it mood right now. This is so beautiful. It's got the like cream fur lining, fake fur lining. Let me just give you a show of it on. I absolutely love this. I think it is so pretty. It kind of gives us like, I should be on the back of a motorbike vibe, racer girl vibe, like where is she? But I think this is so pretty and it's actually really thick and warm. Like it's such a good quality. The fur is like so soft and the leather feels like a nice material as well. But I just think this is so pretty. I really like the look of it. And yeah, it's got like a zip if you wanted to zip it up, but I probably wouldn't. I never fasten coats up, you know, that's the thing about me. Oh, I don't like the way it looks on a zip. I probably wouldn't be doing that. But I would wear it like this. I think it looks super cute. And I just really like the style of it. So let us know what you think. Okay, guys. So all of these items are from Pretty Little Thing. So the first thing I have on is a cropped shirt. Now, I love the Czech Nova print. I actually have quite a few shirts in that print. It's like my favourite print. I think it's beautiful because it reminds us of Burberry. And Burberry is my favourite designer. I love it so much. But yeah, and I've not got a cropped shirt. And sometimes when I'm wearing shirts, I feel like they're just a little bit too long. So I thought, I'm going to get a cropped shirt and see how I feel about that. I actually really like it. So it's a brown cropped shirt. It's got a bit of white in it, a bit of darker brown. You can see here, but it's quite cropped. So, And I just feel like it really does look so cute. Um... And like I said, I've not got a cropped shirt. I feel like it just adds something to my wardrobe. If I'm fancying a shirt vibe, but I don't want the full-on length of a shirt, get a cropped shirt. Who knew? Okay, the next two items, I adore these. And I did that thing where I buy them in several colours. So I also have these in brown as well. But I can't show you them on because they're in the wash because I've already wore them. But I'll put a picture on the screen now of the outfit, the brown version that I wore. Because it was beautiful and I loved it. But this is the joggers now i love these joggers they have a corset waist so you pull the waist in and i just think they make you look so pretty like they make my waist look so toned and i love it now they are wide leg so if you are a cuff jogger type of girl you're not gonna like these because they are wide leg and yeah they're just wide leg so if that's not your vibe you're not gonna like them but the waist of these just looks so pretty that I, I just find myself reaching for them all the time like i said i've got the brown version as well and i really really love them and then i've just paired it with this little black racer top which kind of has subtle line detailing on it don't know how well you can see that i got this in a beige nudie color as well so um i did buy both of these in the brown version as well but i just think it's such a cute little outfit i really like the way that the racer top looks i think it sits nice especially if you have like 
like a nice statement necklace on i think it's really complimenting it's quite high neck not a turtleneck not a v-neck it's like a round normal neck but it's quite high but i really love both of these i think they're absolutely beautiful and i've been wearing the brown version quite a lot so who is she she is here who is her? Anyway, I really like these. These are a yes from me. Okay, guys, so the next item I have is a boiler suit. Now, I had boiler suits when they first became trendy about, was it maybe two years ago now when they first came out and everyone had them? I had some then and I liked them and I did wear them, but then I kind of went off them. I had this like nice, it was actually pretty similar to this. I had one from Primark that I resold on my Depop because I'm not sure, I just didn't really know how to style them and I think I went off them a bit. But now I'm kind of back on the boiler suit vibe and I say that they're selling on all the shops again. So I got this one from Pretty Little Thing. It's like a dark denim boiler suit. I really like it and I really like how it looks with an underlayer of a white turtleneck. Which, to be honest, I probably would pull the white out the bottom just so you can see it because i think it gives you that nice contrast but i really like the style of this i like the zip i like the placement of like the pockets on the top i like how it's long sleeved i think it's really complimenting my body type and what i really like is the jeans on this one aren't like baggy they're kind of thin so the one i had from primark was like mum jeans so i feel like the whole boiler suit just looked quite baggy and big and like disorientated but i feel like because the jeans on this one are quite tailored like quite thin they look better but yeah i actually really like the way that this looks it's something that i definitely would wear i think you could style it up if you're going for like a really nice meal and drinks or you could style it down and i like it that much that i bought it in black so let's see the black version on and i feel like i'm gonna like the black version just that little bit more because everything looks better when it's black i feel like black really does complement your body a bit more okay guys so my visions and thoughts and everything like that was correct because i absolutely love the black version i think this just looks much more what's the word elegant i don't know i like jeans and i like blue jean but i just like black jean better and i think this looks so nice i really like how it's got pockets because i do actually stand with my hands in my pocket quite a lot and i realized that's probably a habit i should get rid of but what can you say i'm a hand in the pocket type of girl anyway i really love this i love the leg fit i love the top fit the top fit's quite big on the arms which i didn't really expect i feel like it's a bigger fit than the blue but i'm not mad still love it it's got the rose gold detailing on the pocket i just vibing with this and i feel like the boiler suits are coming back and they're coming back strong and when we all get out this lockdown i feel like everybody's going to be in a boiler suit maybe they won't maybe it'll just be me maybe i'll be rocking up in the boiler suit but hey i'll not be mad at it that's for sure i feel like they're just quite compliment aren't they like these ones as well especially because the legs are tighter i do think are very very complimenting and i love a clothes that compliments us so the next items that i've got on one is from pretty little thing which is the tennis skirt i absolutely love the fit of this tennis skirt so i thought tennis skirts didn't fit me because i got one from boohoo and then i had a traumatic experience with this skirt as a child watch my boohoo all to find out about that but since i've been buying more tennis skirts there's some that are styled that i actually really like on me and i like this one it's nice it's got a check nova pattern it's kind of creamy brown but then it has black peach and white detailing on it so i'll just give you a little close-up i get clueless vibes from this which i really like and then this brown baggy outer shirt is from nasty gal which i really like i've styled it with this because i think it kind of gives the outfit a more casual look which i really like but i really love this outfit it's definitely something that i would wear i can just imagine myself going for a nice little picnic or i don't know just something cute but i really really love this outfit i think it's nice shoes wise i think i could go with either like a white trainer to make it more like what would you say like tomboy -y? or if i wanted to make it quite a girly outfit then i could go with like a boot or i could even wear my um knee high boots with this outfit actually i probably would do that i think that would look quite cute but i really love this outfit i think it's probably my favorite one from the haul so yeah uh, actually the black boiler suit is up there like that's a good boiler suit but i feel like this is just bougie a bougie a bougie okay so thank you so so much for watching this video i really hope you enjoyed it and yeah i hope you liked the items that i got let us know what your favorite item was below let us know how you would have styled the items and let us know if there's anything that you just think i should never wear again like if there's something that you've seen in this video and you think that it should never go on my body again tell us okay because we're all friends here and i need you to be that brutally honest friend that be truthful so yeah thank you so much for watching and i'll hopefully see you again soon for another one bye